please welcome to the stage Joanne Luland with The Local Majority. Hi, everybody. Um, thank you for coming. And I'm so glad to follow the woman who just was up because my job is to make state legislative races look sexy which is not easy because nobody even knows. But we're gonna lose Roe v. Wade. I just wanna scare you with two things. We are going to lose Roe v. Wade in the next two years. 21 states will make it completely illegal to have an abortion. Or the next thing they wanna do, in case everybody thinks I'm chicken little, but then it's, it was in Paul Ryan's budget for years, which is to get rid of birth control for women. So that will be the next thing those states do because they believe, and there's three people on the Supreme Court who have written that, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, birth control, female birth control, not condoms, female birth control is an abortant. So those states are going to make birth control illegal. So I'm just wanting to scare you with that. The other thing is state legislators, legislatures are so crucial because of the fact that everybody talks about getting rid of the Electoral College. We are not gonna get rid of it with a constitutional amendment. That will not happen. But a friend of mine, John Cosa, has been working on the national popular vote for 15 years. He now has 180 committed um, uh, electoral votes from different states that are, are going to do the national popular vote but we have to get to 271, and that means state legislatures. It used to be a bipartisan issue until you know who got in the White House. So that is why state, if nothing else scares you, that should scare you about why state legislatures are absolutely crucial. And as we get um, Nevada and Oregon and maybe Maine, even though we have a majority there, Maine is completely cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, and, um, and so we are going to get more and more and more electoral votes. The last 60 of the 271 are what's gonna be really difficult work, which is why state legislatures matter. What local majority does, local majority, uh, what we do is we provide for state legislative candidates, we provide research that they want on and that they want to use for their policy issues. Now everybody says, oh, don't worry about that. It's all personality. It's all of this, it's all of that. People shouldn't talk about um, what they think is, uh, is important in terms of their policies. I disagree. I think people need to know. And what we do is we provide, we have an all volunteer group. So any of you that are state legislative candidates or work with state legislative candidates, see me. We have a whole volunteer group for the last two years, for those of you who work for two years and four months, we have six PhDs, we have six lawyers, we have three tech analysts and tech professionals. We have three uh, professors, two from Stanford, one from Notre Dame to Demure, and we have doctors, we have nurses, we have business people all doing this research. So we have extreme deep research and we, are, we worked in Virginia in 17, we worked in Florida, Miss, Michigan, and Minnesota in 18, and we're back in Virginia in 19. And we've already done uh, 15 papers for Virginia. And uh, we do the legislative summary, what's happened in the last two years in the state legislature of Virginia, and with just two people in the Senate and two people in the House, the stuff that they have done and killed that the Democrats brought up and what they are doing is unconscionable. Uh, we've done education papers, opioid issue papers, sea level rise, gerrymandering, youth voter turnout, LGBTQ rights, the racial wealth gap, criminal justice reform, the ALEC issue paper, what the Koch, how the Koch brothers are buying state legislatures. And that is what it is that we do. If anybody wants to help, these are the kind of reports we do, and we do talking points for every one of the reports. The candidates can't get enough of it. They're very excited. If you have a computer, five hours a time, and you know anybody who's a introvert that doesn't like to knock doors or make phone calls or text people out of the blue, but really wants to help candidates, please look me up or go to localmajority.org. 
because we're your folks. Thank you very much.